Hi, my name is Alison from Essence Communications. Today I'm going to talk to you about one of our stakeholder engagement tools and we call this the 360 degree stakeholder engagement model. It's 360 degrees because it has four quadrants that I'll take you through to show you exactly how we work with our clients to understand the stakeholder engagement issues that they're dealing with. There are four quadrants and they are generate, navigate, stimulate and evaluate. There are three questions that we seek to answer as part of this generate phase and that is why are we consulting, two, what degree of consultation are we going to undertake and three, what are the non-negotiables as part of this consultation program. Now the second stage of our process is navigate. We think that this part of our program actually differentiates us from other stakeholder engagement consultants. We really look to navigate the stakeholder environment in which we're operating. We conduct an in intensive stakeholder analysis, we do some mapping, we look at who are our stakeholders, what are the risks in engaging with these stakeholder groups. We acknowledge for any stakeholder engagement program there are a set number of risks and that depends on the issue that we're talking about and we also look at how do we manage those risks. So in this process we look at exactly what it is we need to do to understand the environment in which we're about to go and consult in. The third part of our process is stimulate. Now this is the part where the actual event takes place of the consultation but the thing we really focus on is the, how do we stimulate the right level of discussion and debate to answer our questions of consultation. There are three key things that we look at in this stage. The first one is what are the tools that are going to stimulate the right discussion and debate that we need to have for our consultation program. The second thing is what amount of time do we have. Time is a really important thing to understand what we can deliver in this process. And the third thing is the logistics. What do we actually need to do to get the program underway? Now the last part of our process is the evaluate stage and this is actually as per most project management methodologies is looking at what we actually discovered through the consultation phase. There are three key things that we look at as part of this stage and that is what they said as well as what they meant and what it means for us in moving forward, what it actually delivers for us in being able to make decisions about moving forward. And thirdly, what did our stakeholders actually think about this process? We think that's a really important part of evaluating the program. So we actually take our stakeholders through an assessment as part of the process and they get to give us some feedback on the actual consultation. We actually see this as being part of the ongoing stakeholder engagement process. So that sums up our four stage stakeholder engagement process. We've written an e-book on this that you can check out at our website at Essence. We look forward to seeing you again next time. Yes.